We like the onboard TIG, you're go to load and maneuver, and we are 20 seconds from spreading. This is Mission Control Houston. You're watching a series of replays from the Kennedy Space Center of today's launch of the shuttle Discovery and its seven crew members. The launch occurring just 18 minutes ago. Discovery systems in good shape. The crew beginning the early stages of its post-insertion checklist setting up shop uh, for the ride to the International Space Station and a docking on Monday, the ensuing nine days of joint docked operations with the International Space Station crew. On board the space station, Commander Sergei Volkov and Flight Engineers Oleg Kononenko and Garrett Riesman watched the launch of Discovery on a television feed that was uplinked to them. So Riesman uh, fully aware that his replacement, Greg Shamatov, is on his way now to begin the handover operations that uh, will highlight uh, part of the nine days of joint docked operations once Discovery arrives at the complex. As we continue to watch the replays of uh, Discovery's launch, the booster officer here in Mission Control reports that the, uh, the dump of the remaining fuel in the main propulsion system of Discovery has been complete. Everything looking good on board the orbiter. Countdown clocks ticking backwards uh, to the ignition of the orbital maneuvering system engines 15 and a half minutes from now. A fairly substantial Ohms 2 burn that uh, will further refine uh, Discovery's apogee turn it uh, from a highly elliptical orbit into a more circular orbit as it uh, begins its chase to catch up to and dock with the International Space Station Monday afternoon.
The mechanical systems officer reports that the external tank uh, doors on the uh, belly of the orbiter are in the process of closing per the procedures. As Discovery passes uh, high over Europe, preparing uh, for the firing of the orbital maneuvering system engines and the first uh, of its rendezvous burns, the OMS-2 burn, to further refine its orbit, the International Space Station moving from northwest to southeast at an altitude of about 210 statute miles, currently flying over the United Arab Emirates. Go ahead, Discovery. Yeah, we're uh, through with uh, through page 3-7, and we'd like to put uh, block 3 of post-insertion at station config and work. Okay, copy that. 